Eleven years ago to the day, Ben Robert Smith was under fire in the heat of battle in Tizak, Afghanistan. It was his actions in combat that would deliver him the highest military award. An award he now says is the source of envy, not admiration, from some of his former SAS colleagues. It put a target on my back, he told the federal court. As soon as you become a tall poppy, that gives people the opportunity to belittle you, drag you down and undermine you, and use that award against you out of pure spite. He told the defamation hearing it was after 2011 when he was presented with the Victoria Cross that his relationship with other SAS personnel soured. I loved the job. I loved the professionalism involved. It has also brought me a lot of misfortune and pain. He gave the example of returning to base camp after a dangerous overnight mission in Afghanistan in 2012 to find belittling messages about him on a notice board. Yes, people were jealous of the awards, he said, and in other cases it just provided them an opportunity to broaden their attacks on me because it suited them. His solicitors claim it was this jealousy that inspired some of his former colleagues to leak false information for the 2018 nine newspaper articles that he claims destroyed his reputation. Before the court went into closed hearings today, Ben Robert Smith specifically addressed one of the key media allegations, that he kicked an unarmed man off a cliff and ordered his execution in 2012. He said an enemy spotter was shot in the field that day, but reading articles suggesting it was a brutal murder have been an unbelievable nightmare. Josh Bavis, ABC News, Sydney.